Envision Charlotte is a sustainability initiative for downtown, or as we call it, uptown Charlotte. And so what we're focused on is commercial buildings and reducing that energy usage by 20%, water by 20, waste diversion to landfill of 20%, and then an air pillar as well. And the reason we do this is for economic development. The more uh, we work on these and the less it costs the buildings to, do, to operate, the better it is for businesses to move to Charlotte. We announced our first results of, of achievement back in June, and that was an 8.4% reduction in energy. 6.2% of that was behavior, and then the rest was operational changes, upgrades to buildings. So we want to get tenants engaged into the process of reductions, because that also translates to home. So we start with the behavior piece. We teach people how to turn off lights, how to turn off monitors, unplug cell phones, and we play games like crab at your it. You know, crabs like to go towards the light, so if you get crabbed, better turn your lights off. Uh, so we start with behavior, and then we are moving over into the operational side. And what we've done is we have a partnership with UNC Charlotte um, and their uh, engineering department. And so their professor and their engineers go to buildings with us, and we do an audit of the building. We're vendor agnostic and project agnostic. So we look at it and see how they can get 20% more efficient um, through building upgrades and what that costs. Some buildings are looking for a one to three year return on investment. Some are looking for deep energy retrofits, but that's how we're gonna get the next 11.6% of savings. Helping buildings figure out the best way to become more efficient through neutral parties looking at it. So the next pillar we have to work on is water and that's with our fabulous partner, ITRON. And so what we're doing right now is we're putting up the infrastructure just like we did on water or on energy so that we get the meters to, to gather the real-time water data to set that baseline. And then we'll implement programs to reduce water. We also have waste, which um, we are going to censor up all the dumpsters in our uptown and start measuring real-time waste, uh, which is unprecedented. It's pretty exciting in the United States. And so we look to launch that pilot project the first of next year. And we have already had a commitment from NVO, our partner company there, to give us sensors for all 61 buildings. We also have the air pillar, which is going to be focused around transportation and reducing the single occupancy car driver. Um, and so that will be probably third to fourth, fourth quarter next year. When you start giving people data and information, it automatically changes your behavior because you just start being more aware of what you're doing. So one of the things that we're doing in gathering all of this data is helping building managers look at their BAS systems and to just, you don't need to turn the building on at four o'clock in the morning if you don't have people coming in till eight. And to see the savings has been huge. If you look at the tenant side, one of our partner buildings, the government center, they have little refrigerators in all the individual units, which, I mean, they're, they're college refrigerators, but they suck up an enormous amount of energy. Well, we're going to give them dashboards so that they can see what their individual impact is in their workstation. And I think that that, as much as they want their sandwich and their Coke right next to them, walking to the break room and saving the building money and saving all the you know, environmental impacts, I think will be huge. So there's that two sides that you have to look at when you're helping a building, both the individual side and the property manager or building owner side. ITRON is one of our favorite partners. They get it. They see where the future of cities are going. I think there are a lot of other companies that could bring in other um, aspects and truly create a model that could be replicated throughout the United States and take us to the next level.